Pathetic, Dallas. Just absolutely pathetic. Our offense was just horrible. I mean, that first play, that first drive was, I mean, the only, the best drive we had, which isn't saying much, was our first drive, and it was for a field goal, which was for our only points. When I say best drive, that's not saying much because we just had nothing. We did nothing for the whole game. I mean, Zeke had some good runs, but, um, but Dak was terrible. Our defense was put in really bad positions. Yeah, especially, I mean, our defense kept it a game. I mean, until until late in the first half, when we went up 12 to three, or when we fell behind 12 to three, I mean, even though they knew a two possession deficit against Tom Brady and the Bucks going into the half could be deadly. They still they still let them get another field goal. Second half they we allowed them their first touchdown of the game, and that's all they needed. With the with the offense as pitiful as we played, and then on top of that, Dak has a thumb injury. And is expected to be out and to have surgery like like within the next couple days or so. And he is expected to be out until we play either Chicago or Green Bay. We got our work cut out for us. I mean, record wise, we uh, it's just one just week one and we're oh and one and um you know we responded well um uh the last time we started oh and one which was last year i mean we did make we did win the division and qualify for the playoffs but but in the playoffs we blew it i mean i felt like they re i mean Last season when we started 0-1, we responded well, but um, with Cooper Rush in, it doesn't look like that's going to happen. I mean, he led us on a comeback victory in Minnesota when Dak was out for that game with a calf injury. Um, I mean, anytime you... It's all, it's pretty much about finding a way to win every game without Dak, which seems like it's going to be a almost impossible task. And I, which I don't think the Cowboys will be up for. I never saw no fight in them. I mean, both games... The Texas Alabama game and the um, uh, Dallas Tampa Bay game both had the star quarterback go down. I mean, Texas early on and Dallas late in the game. In the case of Alabama Texas, Texas busted their butts and fought and fought till the end but Dallas showed no fight they just just gave up and accepted defeat I mean Dallas could take a few Dallas could have taken a leaf 
out of the Texas Longhorns book with the way they continued to fight against Alabama with with uh, Hudson Card, the backup quarterback, playing his guts out even with a bad leg. I didn't see Dallas do any of that or play with anywhere near that intensity. Just, I mean, record-wise, um, early on, we got to, if we can stain some wins, which I don't see, string wins together, which I don't see happening. I mean, it's going to be an uphill battle with Dak. I mean, even when Dak was playing in this game, our offense was nowhere to be found. I mean, and the penalties killed us, too. It was just everything that went, everything that could have gone wrong, went wrong. That's not much to say about that. We'll see you next week against Cincinnati. Go Cowboys.